This is Ralph Herbert at Easton Stadium where Sunday afternoon the UCLA Bruins defeated Arizona to take the final game of their three-game series. I'm here with UCLA head coach Kelly Inouye Perez and coach Always good to get a win against your rival, but under the circumstances, this win really was crucial. Oh, you know, I think it's uh, every win at this point in season um, is a big win. And this team, uh, if I had to say one word about this team, this, this team has been resilient. You know, we've been through a lot this season with injuries and people in different positions, and I continue to change the lineup. And uh, everybody continues to get out here and give everything they can to help the team. Today was about um, our pitchers. They came out and they competed. Uh, real gutsy performance by Destin Rodino. It's, it's why she's a Bruin. She loves to compete. And a solid performance from Jay Hall. For her to be able to come in as a freshman and, and shut them down the way they did uh, sent a lot of confidence to the team. And it really led to a real big win for us today. And with shuffling the lineup, it means that a lot of players are getting put in positions to make plays, and you're getting that experience. So, again, as the season progresses, you know you've got players on the field and on the bench that can perform. You know, um, that was something that we, we had said. Last year, our depth was our strength. And uh, in 2011, I really started the season saying versatility is going to be our strength. And um, as you can see it, I have freshmen out there that are just jumping right in. Um, Big-time performances from them being able to compete out there. And people in different positions, offensively and defensively. And I said that. The, it's going to come down to defense. No matter where you are, you have to be prepared to come in and help the team. And I was very proud of their defensive performance today. After a couple of tough weeks of Pac-10 play, how much pressure does this take off of the locker room? You know, for us at this point in season, uh, you know, we, we know the Pac-10. We understand the Pac-10. We prepare for it. At this point in season, um, I break down the season into segments, and we're, we're in the never let up season. We know postseason is right around the corner. We get that. And in the Pac-10, you're not going to get any breaks. So you, you don't let up. In the, you know, in the same breath, you don't take anything for granted because every game you play it like it's your last game. Uh, and this team is very focused. It was a big win. The most important day for us is today. So we walk away. Being, it's a great day to be a Bruin today. And it's especially great to get a win on Senior Day. Oh, yeah. I, you know, we always play with a little more inspiration on, on Senior Day, knowing that it potentially could be our last game. Um, and, uh, you know, every senior got to, almost every senior got to get into the game except for Donna. Um, but the girls were, were, were very inspired today because it was more, it's not just about the outcome here at UCLA. Um, it's about wearing the four letters, being able to wear it with pride, being able to play for each other. And there was a lot of emotion today. Um, and it was great to be able to come out with a W. And now you can take that confidence on the road to Eugene next week against Oregon. Oh, yeah. We're playing it one pitch at a time. That's all we have control over. Um, and at this point, we're still working on getting 1% better. You know, for us, at this, we're, we're really focusing on being more consistent um, in every part of our game. And this is a great start getting into next weekend. All right, Coach, thanks for the time. Good luck next week. I appreciate it. Once again, UCLA, a winner over Arizona. The Bruins back in action as they travel to Eugene next weekend to take on the Oregon Ducks. Of course, the best news and notes on UCLA softball. Get it all right here at UCLA Bruins dot com.